hey guys welcome back to my channel so hello everyone um so today we are actually going to some car boot sales which i am so happy to be finally be doing more videos like this because i know you guys absolutely loved the other ones so i'm so excited to be doing them again i'm so sorry that i i literally promised that i was going to be doing loads of them this summer but I've had to be working a lot of the Sundays, so that's why there's like only two car boot videos on my channel, which is shocking because I really wanted to do more. But anyways, so unfortunately, though, I don't have my chest mounted strap today. I have no idea where it's gone. I've looked everywhere this morning and plus we're already running late as I've overslept. It is almost eight o'clock in the morning. <laughs> And the one that I love going to starts at half past four in the morning. So I'm praying that there's still people there. If not, we can always go to a different one that starts a bit. But well, that started a little bit later on. But so today I'm just going to have to try my best with the filming and like holding the phone right. Sorry if the footage is like a little bit shaky or just not in frame with some things. But I, I promise I'll try and find the chest mounted gopro but anyways as we are already late i think we should definitely go and get ourselves there and let's go see if it's you know if it's still okay at eight o'clock in the morning because a lot of people do go early on in the morning for car boots because that's where when all the good stuff comes out so hopefully we can still find some really good pieces today but anyways let's go So first pick up, I got this Betty Boop glasses case for 50p and how cool is this?
so i have finished looking around this one but i think i'm gonna go and i don't know which one to go to it's like either stafford carboo or leek carboo i don't know but i mean i found i think four things in total i'll show you them at the end of the video i actually came to this one last week and i found so much and i actually met a lovely subscriber so if you're watching hello <laughs> um but yeah i mean not the best one i mean it's very busy like don't get me wrong there's a lot of like sellers here but sometimes it's just luck and plus i did come a little bit late so i probably missed out on a lot of like the good stuff you know but anyways let's go ahead and go up to uh i think i'm gonna choose leak car boom i'll see <laughs>
I'm back in my car now and I have finished I think um that is everything at leak it was it's pretty good to be honest I did pick up a few bits which I will show at the end of the video but now I'm gonna get home I might grab myself a drink like a Starbucks maybe um and I'll give you the haul at the end so stay tuned and stick around for the end I really hope to do more car boot videos because I love going to them so much I normally go to them in like you know like my free time and like sometimes I don't even film them but I've started to film them and to be honest I'm really happy with the like the support on my last car boot video so thank you so much I really want to be able to do more of them but it is September the 1st today and that normally means some of them might not be going on because you know the weather is a bit getting, gonna get colder but it's all weather dependent really so fingers crossed it doesn't drop really cold all of a sudden and we won't be able to do any but i know a lot of you have been asking about my thrifting videos yes they are coming back don't worry just don't don't worry <laughs> um hopefully i'll be making one next week at some point but yeah so let's go home and i'll see you in the hall hello everyone so it is a couple days later and i was like gonna be ready to like do a massive haul for you but I actually ended up putting all the stuff, not all of it, that's a lie, on Vinted and I've actually sold everything so I can't exactly show you. I'll insert the pictures that I put on Vinted, I think I still have them hopefully, but I sold the O'Neill coat that I got, um, I can't remember what else I got now, but I went to a car boot like the week before and I didn't film so I guess I'll just show you what I got from there because I am still gonna just put some more stuff on Vinted. So make sure you go follow my Vinted actually. I'm gonna put my name here. I'm always posting stuff and if you guys want UK based only, like I can't ship international, but if you have anything like you guys want, like if I'm out in the charge shops, if I'm going to a car boot, then just let me know and hopefully I could find it and then you could buy it off my vintage so <laughs> just like comment down below or give me a message on Instagram and I'll just be happy to do that and I'll always let you know when I'm going to be posting it on my vintage so yes but let's get on with what I found the week before so here's the bag it's not exactly a lot of stuff I didn't film this one I don't think I can't actually remember which ones I've been to here we go so I thought this was really cute I'm not gonna sell this I don't think but how adorable is this little cardigan I thought it'd be perfect with a dress I mean the weather's not really nice now but I think it's really nice. It's from Urban Dream. I'm not sure what brand that is but it's got a little cut out love hearts if you can see. That is so cute. I think I got this for a pound. I think I might sell this one because I don't actually wear stuff like this. It's not my style. Um, Let me just get it up for you. But it's like a green like kind of like tight fitting like jacket like i just thought maybe with some low-rise jeans this would look really cool or even like a mini skirt but i got this for a pound as well and that's the brand i can't actually pronounce it myself i'm rubbish at pronouncing things but yeah this might go on my vintage i'm not sure i'll have to like try it with outfits that i've got and see if it looks okay on me now this is one million percent going on my vintage i was i literally had to get this <gasps> it is a brand new playboy clock like how crazy is that so i got it for three pounds um it just needs new batteries and it's all got the box but i think they have like used it because at the top it has a few marks but i can just you know clean it up but how cool this would look in someone else's bedroom because my bedroom is all vintage vibes, not pink Playboy stuff. But I just thought this is such a collectibles piece and yeah, for £3 you can't go wrong. So I'm really happy with that. Stay tuned on my vintage. Lastly, I think I might keep this one for myself, but I found a Harley Davidson t-shirt and this one was £2, I think, which is crazy for Harley because... These sell for a lot of money online, so I just thought it's like a really nice graphic tee. It's quite oversized as well, so it's just perfect for me. But yeah, 
I'm just really happy with all the things that I found last week and actually <laughs> also I like to collect jelly cats so whenever I'm in the charity shops or a car boo I'm always looking and I actually found one at the car boo like oh my god look how cute he is so there's the tag and I got him for one pound I was so shocked I thought she was gonna say like something like more maybe like even 10 pounds and no she was just like a pound so I was like yes please <laughs> anyways that's gonna conclude today's video I really hope you enjoyed it and thank you so much for all of the support and comment down below if I've missed anything in the video whilst I've been filming and just comment down below your favorite item that I found see you in the next video bye